Hey, Delusive here. In this video, I'll be going through essence linking and how to get your essence from your nexus to your altar. Uh, one of the first things you'll need is this crystal wrench. And it's made simply with iron ingots, vintium dust, desert nova, and a blue orchard. The desert nova and blue orchard are found in the world gen so desert novas in the desert and blue orchard in grassy areas. You also want to have a few of these essence conduits. They're made just easily with stone and shimmer above it. So you can make a whole bunch if you want. And also you'll want to make these mana batteries. And in this version, I'll go through in a bit what also the mana batteries do and why it's no use building these neutral essence. So to make the mana batteries it's just the chimerite or with vintium around it and arcane ash in the middle. So once you have a crystal wrench and your mana battery you'll want to place either your mana battery near your nexus or if you can't for some reason you just place a, a line of essence conduits uh, and link them all because the essence conduits act kind of like nodes from your nexus to your destination wherever that be so in this case I've just placed my mana battery next to the nexus to make it easy so to link the mana battery with the nexus you just get your crystal wrench and right click on the nexus and then you'll see a beam and then you just right click on where you want it to link to so I wanted to link to the mana battery so I did that now for the mana battery to absorb instead of just emit you'll want to place a redstone torch next to it this without without a redstone torch see that beam it just absorbed some then with without the redstone torch it wouldn't have done that it would have just emit so make sure you have the redstone torch there to make sure it's getting the essence from the nexus and you can see the charge at any time by right clicking. You can also have the nexus link to the essence conduits in the same way. So over here in my actual setup I've got my nexus linking to the banner battery which links to this conduit, which links to this conduit, which links to my crafting altar. So how I did that was simple just again right click links it to the mana battery right clicking then you right click on the mana battery where you want it to go to this conduit okay from this conduit so I'm doing this just by right clicking you see the beam that's its destination and from here I want it to link to oh, my I think you right click that yeah, right click on the crafting altar block in the center there. And that'll link this conduit to, to the crafting altar. So the, the entire route is from the nexus, battery, conduit, conduit, and altar. You can also just make it go from nexus to battery to this essence refiner. I'll go through the essence refiner and everything in the next video as well. So now that they're all linked, I'll go through why I'm linking it through this mana battery. Now this one's charged at 100% because I've been playing for a few days with it. Now the this nexus is generating light essence. But in this current version, Mythion has made it so that the mana battery only emits neutral essence. So you can charge this mana battery up with light essence and then have it emit neutral essence. You can also have it a uh, dark essence and go into the mana battery and it will still just emit neutral essence. This is uh, to counter the the rareness of the liquid essence. So you know one one bucket of liquid essence is, gives pretty much 0.4 charge level on this battery and it's it's not much at all. It's like when you're using this es essence refiner um, using the neutral 
this nexus here it took about eight to ten buckets to make one um, one of the elements which isn't really you know balanced so to counter that he Mythian has decided to um, make the mana batteries for now emit neutral essence so instead you can just make your light nexus and have it go into the mana battery and to your altar so once you've got this set up you'll you'll want to find a recipe or you've already got a recipe that needs this neutral essence so when you're doing that all you have to do let's set up this this recipe so all right we'll go through this it's down I'll just cheat these in again Put that in okay and when you see something like this this is when it's asking for the essence so as long as you've linked it properly and you've got the required essence ready so either in your nexus or in a battery you just go to the switch and flip it and then as we can see here the beam is going through these burn out and, and it's given the altar what it needed so now it's asking for the rune and the other and just like the other basic recipes that's it so if anyone had any difficulty in any part this kind of went through it I know when I first started with this I didn't know about this crystal wrench and how to link to from the nexus to the uh, altar yeah thanks for watching and in the next video i'll be going through how to make each element in this refiner